What's up you guys, Zanaku back with another video and today I'm actually going to tell y'all on how to keep your Camaro clean. There's plenty of ways to keep your car clean just in general. Uh, I know a lot of car enthusiasts, we go crazy. We, we try to detail the crap out of our cars. But unfortunately for mine, I wasn't able to keep it real good during when I got it to now. So I'm trying to fix it up. And there's a video, I actually, I'm, I'm trying to edit out a little bit because it's like 20 minutes on one, 7 on the other, and 7 on the other. Reason being is because it was mostly me holding the camera, and then my wife came out just for a couple of minutes to help me do it. But it's a it's a carbon fiber hydro dipped, hydro dipped carbon fiber center console, and it looks really good. Let me show you all that real quick, and then I'll get back to what I was doing. Just got done washing up the car, and this is what it looks like. <sighs> All the way down there, all the way down here. Looks real good. So, now let me get back to what I was talking about on how to keep the Camaro clean. As y'all can see, I just got done washing the Camaro. Took longer than expected, but you know what? That's what it comes with when you're like super trying to keep it clean. Get a new bumper, so this crap right here is not gonna be happening for long. I ripped it a long time ago in college. Uh, it was, I don't, I, I don't know how to explain it. Actually, let's get to back to the point. Tires look really good. I just shined them up. One shield is good. I'm going to actually buy me another one because I got a crack. Yes, I know it's a small crack, but honestly, the people that replaced this one the last time did not do a very good job because in the inside, it is just, uh, it's a pain in the butt. So, I got the Camaro all cleaned up, but I wanted to show y'all what I actually used to clean my Camaro. So... As y'all can see, I got my own little pressure washer. I got this at Harbor Freight. It has four different nozzles. Those nozzles over there. That black one is soap. That uh, that one's white. That's missing. It should be on the nozzle right here. Yep. So that's white. That's 50% uh, water. Green is 25%. And then the red is 0%, which means it's just a giant straight line. Which is not bad when you need to cut through weeds and all that. So, let's get back to where I was at. So, what I use, remember, I'm not sponsored by any of these people. I'd love to be, but I doubt it. So, I used an AutoZone uh, bucket because it actually came with a lot of good stuff. So, when I bought this, they had a sale for either $25 or $30 or $35. It was the bucket. There's a black drainer down there so you don't get any mud on your stuff. It came with, uh, what? It came with the interior cleaner which I'm actually going to use in a bit because this stuff actually works really great and I bought this at AutoZone separate this right here I enjoy the coconuts honestly I enjoy coconut smell so one just wolf of this right here just like it smells so good when you put it in the car like I'm telling you uh, and this is an old product that I actually have still I actually still use this every now and then just not often I actually tried uh, I tried this one out today and that's why my tires look so real good right now it would actually be this. Ooh, 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 and this actually came with the auto, auto, uh, AutoZone kit. So it's a hot shine tire coat. Uh, gives the tires a black wet look, which, I mean, it, it looks really good. So I mean, that, that wasn't bad. And then it also came with this. This was the last thing it came with, was this right here. And I actually used this on my rims. Or no, 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 I, I used them. Um, so I used this on the car, but before I used this, as y'all can see over here in my pressure washer, this is actually electric. So that down there is actually a soap compartment. So when I got that, I went to O'Reilly's and I bought this. Because I enjoy the turtle wax. And I mean, it happens to have all three, you know, removes dirt and grime, which it does a decent, decently good job. It doesn't do a very good job. Like, it just, it's an okay. So those of y'all that are getting this, it's okay. It's not... It's not the best, honestly. Aggressive. Uh, removes bugs and mud and salt. Uh, I don't know. I know a lot of the stuff is gone because I used the zero on my pressure washer. And then removes brake dust and get a sap. That, I don't know because I still got a lot of brake dust. But that's like two years of it building up. And that was because of my dumb... Well, just my fun in general. So, I used this first in the pressure washer. Then, I scrubbed it. 
I actually have the a scrubber inside, but this is pretty much what I use right here for the rims to scrub in between the rims and on the vehicle because it is so soft, it's microfiber, and it, it gets a good deep, you know, good deep in there. And then this down here, I haven't actually used this wax. Uh, yeah, I have not used this. I've never used this actually. I know my wife has, and their car looks really good. So since I just talked about everything I just used. This, I, I do recommend this and like the AutoZone package. If y'all go to AutoZone, y'all got like 25 or 35 bucks. Go ahead and get this set, honestly. It is not a bad set at all. And it works really good. So, oh, so I also got a scrubber to get the bugs off in case I need to scrub them off. This is for the car as well. I use this every now and then. I don't use it all the time because I don't really need it all the time. And took that in there these are just microfiber cloud uh, towels that's pretty much all these are and that's pretty much it you guys that's all I use just to clean the car and just to show you how clean it really does look I'll zoom out all the way and get as close as I can I got I got a covered tint uh, lights so I mean those look really good still I'm gonna actually get the interior in just a couple of minutes and uh, tell me if y'all actually want to see me uh, post that video of that hydro uh, hydrocarbon dipped and uh, carbon uh, hydro dip carbon fiber center console which like I said I'm trying to cut as much as I can out of it I'm not trying to make it a long video and see I use the bug spray that bug stuff and it's still I even use my zero and this this stuff is still on there it probably just been on there for quite a while so I'm doing so much stuff to this car you guys trust me this bumper is gonna be either the same or different the hoods gonna be changed out be the exact hood but then i'm gonna give me three hoods so this will be my first hood the other hood will be carbon everything and then the other hood will be if i go with a uh, supercharger and everything like that i'm gonna need a bigger cow i mean i cleaned everything good as best i could but that i still gotta do quite a bit so i guess i'm gonna hit y'all up later and y'all guys take care i'll see you on the next video don't forget to hit that like button subscribe and see y'all later